So I see people every year having this New Year's resolution, going to the gym for about two months, maybe a month, or even a couple weeks, and they cancel their gym membership. Complete waste, in my opinion. Um, you got to put in the work, man. You got to you gotta actually fulfill your goals and go through with it. Write it down if you have to. Put it on a whiteboard. Don't just put it in your phone and forget about it. And if you're thinking about going to the gym, definitely should. Gym makes sex better. More gym, more sex. <laughs> Sup, guys? I hope you're doing well, and I hope you had a wonderful Christmas. Um, I love Christmas. I love lights and all kinds of pretty, pretty fucking lights. Um, I had a good Christmas, and I have some New Year's resolution goals, what I want to kind of improve on. Um, so I've kind of gotten into more like calisthenics and currently doing like four or five days, uh, more like five days of like strict bodybuilding. And then the other two days are like focused on more body weight exercises and calisthenics. Um, I have read a book. The best book I literally read has been this book, The Supple Leopard by Kelly Surratt. You should definitely check it out. It is probably the best book I've ever read on like actually something that's changed my life. I used to like be really on top of mobility, like, you know, stretching like more than 20 minutes a day. Um, I noticed like a lot of pains, especially like in my hip area. I have something called anterior pelvic tilt, butt wink, if you will. Um, a lot of people have that issue and it's really bothering me. <laughs> um, so I'm using the drills and the knowledge in this book uh, to fix that and alleviate that issue that I'm having because uh, I've not only been able to do a handstand for the first time, I've never been able to do a handstand. I know it sounds super stupid, but um, without a wall, uh, I have not been able to do a handstand before. And I think it's really fucking good. I'm on to a good start. Uh, good path to better mobility uh, because doing that requires you to be somewhat more mobile but also have you know the wrist strength uh, the finger strength and the balance um, balance is like fucking everything and I think most people uh, unfortunately are either standing like all day or they are sitting all day um, that can be a problem um, but yeah I'm gonna do probably more videos on more like mobility type of stuff and calisthenics based workouts, um, what you can do possibly without a gym, but I definitely recommend go to the fucking gym. Um, it's like, you gotta go to the gym, man. So besides, uh, spicy OnlyFans content, uh, I always have ideas for that. Um, I definitely want to kind of make my channel more of, uh, I've, you know, definitely have plenty of videos on like more of the informative side of things. Like I enjoy talking about sex drive tips. I enjoy talking about things that actually like helped me and uh, fitness advice, uh, things that most people aren't really talking about, such as like peptides. Um, I know there's videos on that, but uh, I really want to just make this channel a, um, you know, as entertaining as possible, but also informative and kind of sharing like the insights behind, you know, the porn industry and OnlyFans. Cause that's what's, that's what I do for the majority and it's what I enjoy doing. And, um, hopefully you guys enjoy that content. So, uh, yeah, but I definitely, have goals for like my physical th side of things like I want to have better shoulders I want to have bigger shoulders you know so I can have that three-dimensional look um, that's just one of my goals that I have and um, definitely like keep you know the the lean physique that I have right now but um, it's always like improving I've always been about improving and making 
making my physical body better, but also my mind. Um, I think both of those are obviously super important. Um, and you can't achieve a healthy mind and physique without going to the gym, in my opinion, and doing cardiovascular exercises as well as doing mobility, stretching, um, all that stuff is necessary as well as diet. Um, supplementation plays like a 10% role in things and things like peptides and drugs, uh, things like that play like an additional 10, maybe 20% depending on what it is. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time.